I want to start by asking around the Pokemon Center because I really want to know if any of these guys have in-game trades. Do you have an in-game trade? Go on. One of you has to. How about you? Alright, Raichu, but we don't have a Raichu. Yep. You know what? Forget you. I don't need a Raichu. I have a Pikachu and that's strong enough for me. Hey everybody, it's the McMaster 14. Welcome back to more Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu. In the last episode, uh, we battled the, what was it, the 6th gym here in Saffron City. Sorry, I just woke up, my my mind is a little fuzzy. And we got the Soul Badge. No, I... Did we... Yeah, I think it was the Soul Badge. Or, I, I don't remember what badge it was. It was either the Soul Badge or the Marsh Badge. Anyways... In this episode, we're going to be heading down south to the next gym town. So, let's get playing and start by heading back to Fuchsia City. <laughs> we head in here. I believe there's someone who will give us an item that we need. Yeah, this guy. This Lapras is getting uh, is getting on in age, but it's still a real, a real beauty, wouldn't you say? We used to ride on ways and travel the whole world, world together. Splash. Lapras can't swim like it used to, so we'll stay here together. Thank you for listening. As thanks, I'll teach you the secret technique sea, sea scan. With this technique, you can travel on water. Ha! <laughs> Your Pikachu wants to learn it as well? I'm not sure if it can learn it. It's not a water type. You look determined, just, as, just like my Lapras. Okay, I'll teach you, teach you the technique then. Now you have to keep your balance on the water, lower your center of gravity, and keep your balance with your upper body. Pika learned the secret technique ski sea skim. I'll give you that board too. Ride the waves and travel the whole wide world together. Well, we're kind of confined to the Kanto region, but thank you. Uh, I believe in order to get that guy to teach you that technique, you need to be a, you need to beat both Koga and Sabrina first. I think that's actually a requirement. Or maybe it's just Koga. I I honestly don't know. No, no, I'm pretty sure it is Koga and Sabrina. I'm sure of it now. Yeah, the reason why we needed that is obviously because this route here down to the south is a water-based route. Wait, who's in the lead of our party? Probably Pika and Oddball would probably be good spots for the lead because they're strong against water types. Also, I'm pretty sure this is the last uh, technique that we need to learn for Pika. And here's our first encounter on the water. Wild Star you. Oh, how is that not a great throw? Actually, as it's pretty well established in this series, yeah, getting a not getting a great throw actually has lower odds of catching you a Pokemon than getting a non-great throw. Ivan and Pika both leveled up. Maybe something I actually should have checked before I uh, evolved Oddball. I know that certain Pokemon stop learning moves when you give them an evolution. Uh, maybe I actually should have checked to see if Gloom stops learning moves when it, when it evolves, because it honestly might. Should we do a battle? Yeah, let's do it. Swimmer Axel has a Poliwhirl. Bubble Beam, that's not going to do much. Especially since we have Mega Drain. 
Level 42. All right, so we're getting higher level. We're at, we're actually getting to the point where trainer is actually at the level that's closer to our own Pokemon. Sand Slash leveled up. Uh, I do want to do something. I know we got a TM for a stronger move that um, Oddball can learn. Let's see. It was Dazzling Gleam. I think I'll replace Toxic because we actually have a TM for that move. So if I ever want to replace Dazzling Gleam again, I can just do that. Also, sleep is really helpful. There aren't very many encounters here. What is the map looking like? I don't want to make this too long of an episode. This is Route 19, this is Route 20. And the Seafoam Islands are in the middle of Route 20. Okay. Well, Route 19 is actually huge. I really want to get more encounters because, like, we haven't encountered many Pokemon recently. Level 39 Magikarp. We don't really need this one for the Pokedex or anything, but I just really wanted to catch it. I think we're on Route 20 now. Maybe we'll have more encounters here. Well, we can actually, we can definitely do a battle. War Turtle. get to encounter like a war turtle in these waters. Maybe we can as like a rare encounter. Sarmi, okay. This is actually strong against uh Psywave. Yeah, this is actually strong against the uh, oddball. Okay, I thought it was strong because it's psychic and oddball's poison, but I don't think it took that much damage. I'm pretty sure these are the Seafoam Islands. Pretty sure, at least. Seafoam Islands. Oh, it's your friendly potion delivery service. You split the near Pokemon. Okay, uh, let's check out the Seafoam Cave then. Finally, some encounters that are good. Wow, that was almost too early. Alright, let's, let's actually try a berry. We haven't used many berries at all. Excellent. Actually, wait, that means we probably have a low chance of catching it, doesn't it? No, we actually caught it. Alright, maybe, maybe getting excellence and greats actually do increase your chances of catching a Pokemon. Who would have thought?
So new addition to the Pokedex, Slowpoke, a water psychic type. He evolves into Slow Bro, which we saw, I believe, in the last gym when we fought Sabrina. We found an escape rope. Alright, who's this person? If you ever run low, come talk to me. I don't think we're ever gonna run low on Pokeballs. Also, I thought that was a different encounter, but it was just another slow poke. Now let's battle this coach trainer. I don't want to make this. I don't want to make this episode too long because I want to save exploring the Seafo Islands for the next episode. Sends out Jolteon first. Decently high leveled. Thunder, that's not gonna do a whole lot, cause oddball. That's gonna do a bit. Right, let's try Mega Drain this time. Thunder is not a very accurate move. That's why that's why a lot of people don't tend to go for it. I right, think Acid just finishes this Jolteon. Yikes, and, and no full paralysis. That's good. I'm suspecting this guy's going to have Flareon and Vaporeon next. Alright, yeah, Flareon, so we need to switch. We definitely need to switch Oddball out. And right, Loch Ness is absolutely the best choice here. Flare Blitz, this is gonna do nothing. Actually, that did do something. And burn? Or at least we healed the burn, yeah. Burn is actually very bad for Gyarados because it lowers his attack stat by half. Alright, so we KO the Flareon, and last is probably going to be Vaporeon. Raticate is now level 50. And no, no better way to do our last battle for the episode than to uh, switch in Pika. Hydro Pump. This is a very strong water move. Yeah, don't worry. Pikachu's faster and Thunderbolt is probably going to Oko. Oh, not quite. And that was a crit. Wow, Vaporeon is much bulkier than I remember. Oop, full paralysis? No, okay. Maybe I shouldn't have flat switched to Pikachu. All right, um. I guess we'll switch back to Loch Ness. It has It definitely resists water, so even if this somehow doesn't KO, we can still win. Alright, what do we get from this guy? I know we got a reward from other coach trainers. Five rare candies. Okay, that's helpful. Ooh, a slow bro. We gotta catch that to end the episode. Right, we're definitely gonna need Ultra Balls for this. That 
was hoping for first try. Alright, that's not... Probably not gonna get it this time either. There we go! Four hundred and eighty one experience points. And now we probably need to go heal up at that lady outside. Alright. And there is much more to the Seafoam Islands than just what I showed. Alright, so our party's all healed up. So next time on Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu. We're going to be exploring the Seafoam Islands a lot more and hopefully finding something interesting down at the very end. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you can, like, comment, and subscribe as that really help out the channel. And I'll see you guys next time. McMaster, out.